Ikwai, in a, in a game that was such a great team effort, is there anything that stood out to you the most or that you appreciated the most in tonight's win? The defense, um, you know, the Bucks, I believe they're number one uh, scoring points uh, in the game, uh, like 119 or something. But uh, yeah, I think we held them to 105 tonight. So, you know, that, that's just a great defensive effort right there. Thanks, go to Tomer. Hey, Kawhi, congrats on the win. Uh, Nick just spoke to us and told us that he felt like the Atlanta game where you guys came back from 22 down was, was a turning point for you. Chris, like from your perspective, do, do you agree with that? And what do you think has changed since that game? I think uh, we're just being more attention to detail, uh, you know, pretty much, uh, you know, just like I said, uh, you know, the last two games are a transition team. Uh, you know, we came down, felt like we got in our, uh, got in a crowd early and, you know, we're just playing hard uh, from the first quarter to the, um, you know, fourth quarter buzzer. Thanks. We'll go to uh, Mark Medina. Hey, Kawhi, congrats on the win. To follow up on that, what do you think it's going to take to sustain that? You cut out. Hey, sorry about that. I, I was trying to ask, what do you think it's going to take to sustain that level of detail and effort that you, you guys were just talking about? Just keep taking it one uh, game at a time. Uh, you know, uh, always say, but tomorrow uh, presents a different challenge. Um, so just got to come in locked in and, you know, want to play hard, uh, focus on, you know, what we want to accomplish as a team and uh, keep moving forward. We'll go to Sabrina. Hey, Kawhi. Uh, the other night, Reggie said that he, you and PG have been setting the tone defensively a little bit more than the last – in the last couple of weeks, um, is there anything that you're doing differently? You know, have you, you know, decided to take on the best player more often or anything like that? Uh, no, I'm just coming out uh, playing the game, making sure my guys is ready to play as well. Uh, you know, we don't need everyone to win a basketball game, uh, not just me. Uh, as you see tonight, everybody played well, and uh, we need that moving forward. Um, you know, we just it is a weakest link, so. Um, everybody has to stay, you know, connected and knowing what we're doing. Even the guys on the bench, that's, you know, not getting no playing time. We need everybody. Law, you can go ahead. Hey, Kawhi. So this stretch has been uh, with all kinds of different lineups. Uh, Rondo's just joined the team. Uh, Surgeon has been out. And I just want to know from you, uh, you know, as the leader of this team, what kind of how how is that voice been impacting you as far as the voice of Sirs, the voice of Pat, and the last couple of games, the voice of Ray John uh, over these last couple of games? Uh, you know, what kind of impact has that had on you specifically? Um, you know, just like I said, um, you know, we need everybody engaged, even guys that are not getting minutes. So, you know, if they're watching the game, uh, just seeing, uh, you know, what details uh, that, you know, I need to get better at or, you know, um, whoever's on the floor, my teammates, uh, just listening to what they're saying and uh, seeing if I see the same thing when I'm out there. And we got time for one more. We'll take it from Ohm. Kawhi, um, Nick doesn't do a lot of things that really show up in the stat box, but tonight he had that big chase down block, tip and dunk. What are what are some of the things you appreciate the most that he brings to this team? Uh, pretty much what you just said, uh, doing the little things, the things that don't show up on a stat sheet. Uh, you know, him playing defense, putting pressure on, uh, you know, um, on T's best players or their best shooters at times. And um, then just bringing a, you know, veteran presence. And you know what I mean? Uh, you know, he's been great. He's been great for us. And, you know, uh, I like him. He's a team guy.